Dear students, welcome to RV Tutorials. In this video, we are going to locate the irrational numbers on number line. For example, root 2 and root 3. Students, irrational numbers are those numbers that cannot be written as a fraction. First one, locate root 2 on the number line. Students, this is a number line. I have taken 4 cm is equal to 1 unit. From 0 to 1, there is 4 cm, 1 to 2, 4 cm, 2 to 3, 4 cm, like so on. I have denoted 0 is a A alphabet and 1 is a B alphabet. Students, draw the perpendicular line to the number line at B point using this set square. Next step is expand the compass from A to B that is 1 unit and draw the arc from the point B to the perpendicular line as shown. This point is a C point. Join the point A and C. Dear students, A, B, C is a right angle triangle. Using Pythagoras theorem, Pythagoras theorem states that in a right angle triangle, hypotenuse square is equal to sum of the squares of the other two sides. Therefore, I have written this Pythagoras theorem, AC is a hypotenuse, hypotenuse square that is AC square is equal to a b square plus b c square a b square plus b c square this is equal to a b is a one unit one square is there square plus plus b c also one unit square is there square this is equal to one one ja one one square is the one plus plus one square also one this is equal to one plus one that is two a c square is equal to two Taking square root on both sides, AC square, square root of AC square that is AC, this is equal to square root of 2. AC is equal to root 2. The value of AC is equal to root 2. Expand the compass from point A to C, then draw the arc from the point A, it touches the number line. This is a D point, AC is equal to AD, AC is equal to AD, the value of AC is equal to root 2, therefore the value of AD is equal to root 2. Therefore from A to point D the value is root 2, therefore we located the irrational number that is root 2 on the number line. Second problem, locate root 3 on the number line. This is a number line. I have taken 3 cm is equal to 1 unit. From 0 to 1, there is 3 cm. 1 to 2, 3 cm. 2 to 3, 3 cm like so on. I have denoted 0 is a A alphabet and 1 is a B alphabet. Draw the perpendicular line to the number line at the point B using this set square. Take the compass is equal to 1 unit and mark on the perpendicular line from the point B. This is a C point. Join AC. The value of AB is equal to 1 unit and also BC is equal to 1 unit. Therefore, the value of AC is equal to root 2. Next step is draw the perpendicular line to AC from the point C using this set square. Next step is take the compass is equal to 1 unit and mark on the perpendicular line from the point C. This is a D point. 
join ad next step is expand the compass from point a to d and draw the arc from the point a it touches the number line this point is a e point dear students a c d is a right angle triangle using pythagoras theorem pythagoras theorem states that in a right angle triangle hypotenuse square is equal to sum of the squares of the other two sides in this triangle ad is a hypotenuse therefore ad square is equal to ac square plus dc square ac square plus dc square this equal to the value of ac is equal to root 2 root 2 square is there square plus plus the value of dc the value of dc is equal to 1 unit therefore 1 square is there square this equal to square root of square is equal to 2 plus plus 1 square is equal to 1 this equal to 2 plus 1 is equal to 3 therefore the value of ad square is equal to 3 take square root on both sides therefore ad square square root of ad square is equal to ad this equal to square root of 3 therefore the value of ad is equal to root 3 dear students ad is equal to ae therefore ad is equal to ae ad is equal to root 3 therefore ae is also equal to root 3 from point a to e the value v is root 3 dear students we located the irrational number that is root 3 on the number line dear students if you like this video like share and subscribe this channel thanks for watching